Uluri Ashley has already proven that this marriage that she is in right now with Oni is bringing a lot of troubles between both of them. It is bringing so much troubles. She doesn't know what to do. She doesn't know how to attend to all of the troubles that this marriage is bringing her. It is because it is like she doesn't know what she wants to do at all. She doesn't know if Oni still loves her or not. She doesn't know what is going on. It is either they make uh, Oni makes a choice right now, or or is, she should better leave the palace before uh, or, uh, things start to go out of hand. Before things start to go out out of hand, because she can't imagine her own child not getting the uh, OM the Ogunwu name, which is very bad for her, which is very very bad for her. So guys, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on what, when, and when you are actually watching us from. This is Royal G Royal Updates TV, where we bring you top and spicy updates from the entertainment industry and also from the Oni of Ife Palace. Olori Ashley has taken it upon herself that no matter what may happen, no matter what is going on, she is going to be ready to divorce Oni. She is going to be ready to divorce Oni if her child doesn't take on the Ogunwusi name. If her child doesn't bear that name, that is where problem is going to be. That is where problem is going to be. And she is ready to leave it, leave the marriage. She is ready to leave the marriage no matter what all of these Olori, uh, Oloris are saying. No matter what exactly they want to do. No matter what exactly they want to do at all. All of those matters is in their hand. She is not ready to fight for anything. She is not ready to fight for any Rahala at all with all of these Oloris. It is better she leaves the palace for them. It is better she leaves the palace because she cannot see any reason why. She can't capture any reason why her child will be inside of the palace with Oni and yet her child is not getting the Ogunwu name. Why Queen Naomi that is outside of the palace? Queen Naomi that is far away that day is bearing the Ogunwu name. All because he is a son. All because he is a boy. That the girl don't call. Assuming Oni knows that she's not going to go through all of this stress, he should have told her so she will know how to organize her child. Now that it is that, that it is right now, it is already too late for her to even organize anything. It is too late for her to organize anything at all. Because where does she want to start from? Where does she want to go? That is the question we should be asking ourselves. Because there is no single way in any circumstance at all even though you are getting married to a man which is not the um, father of your unborn child, yes? That man is not going to bear that name. So I don't understand what Olori Ashley is busy saying. Threatening you want to leave the palace. Nobody is holding you. Point of correction. Nobody is holding you. So you can leave as soon as possible. Because nobody will come to your aid when things have already gotten out of hands. So guys... Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to drop your comments down at the comment section. Goodbye, y'all.